to my channel. So today I'm here with my Project MC Squared doll, Michaela McAllister. So Project MC Squared is a Netflix series, and it's really awesome. If you haven't watched it, you should go check it out. Um, I heard a lot of people don't like it, but they like the dolls. But I personally love the show, and I can't wait for the next season because it is a cliffhanger, and I really want to know what finds it. What I want to find out what happens. So this is Michaela. She's one of my favorite characters. I think Bryden is my favorite character. So. They have this thing like STEAM for science, technology, engineering, art, and math, and she has all of those, so she's like the best. Like she actually is like the best. And then on the back it tells about her. So it says the name's Michaela McAllister. Writer, hipster, undercover spy, you know, just like every other teenage girl. When I'm not journaling, I'm probably reading a Sir Arthur Con Conan Doyle novel. He's so boss. Performing magic tricks or trying to save the world. I'm smart, get over it. And then there are the other dolls, Bryden Brandwith, Michaela McAllister, Adrian Adams, and Cameron Coyle. And you can follow them on all their social media. And they have a website, projectmcsquared.com. And yeah. So this is one of the dolls that does not come with, like, the um, project. But that's okay, because I probably wouldn't do it anyway. So there's like, a, there's, like, a cutout in the back, probably to make it easier to get her out. So I'm going to, like, uh -huh. I think you're supposed to like push something in. Aha. I have figured that out. That's actually really smart. I think lots of like companies should start doing this. It's honestly so smart. I'm gonna try and pull it out rather than push it in. I feel like pulling it out is easier. Oh, it's like custom fit for her body. That's pretty awesome. Okay, this has to come out too. Okay. So I think I'm gonna have to take her out. So I got like this part out. So she has this brush and it is shaped like an Erlenmeyer flask and it says Project MC Squared on it. And you can use this to brush her hair, which is really cool. And I like how it's shaped. So she has her little legs. These dolls are the less articulated ones. That doesn't really bother me that they're less articulated that she's less articulated. Maybe eventually I'll get the articulated one. But, like I said, it doesn't really bother me. So, I'm just going to cut her free of all this. Okay, so I finally got her out. It took a little bit of elbow grease, but I got her out. And one thing that I absolutely hate that doll companies do is they will, like, stick, like, these pin things in their head to hold them into the box, but then they're stuck in their head and you can't get them out. I hate that so much when doll companies do that, like see this? So I usually just cut them off as much as I can and then see how it goes from there, but I need to fix on her, fix up her hair before I start. start. So I now have to review her on the floor because my camera just died from like doing a bunch of reviews and stuff. So I am gonna film on the floor now. You guys are charged, like plugging in, plugged in and charging. But here is Michaela McAllister. So she's a gorgeous face. She has like these really pretty, like l glossy lips. She has real eyelashes. They're rooted. Her eyes are really pretty and her eye makeup is nice. She has little freckles and her eyebrows look good. She has earrings, which are really pretty. Her hair is gorgeous. I love like the way it looks, the length, the style. So, whoa. I just love her hair. Her outfit. Her shirt is a short sleeve and it says, I like big books and I cannot lie. And she has this um, sweatshirt with a hood, and it's really cool. And then she has this, like, pencil skirt. She has, like, a loose thread pencil skirt, and it's checkered, and I don't think that's attached to each other. I bet she could fit in Barbie clothes, which is awesome. And then she has these really cool shoes. So she's, They're purple. She'd probably on only get to wear these shoes because she has flat feet instead of, like, high-heeled feet like Barbie's. But she's really pretty, and I really like Michaela. And I'm sorry this review turned out so bad just because my camera died, but, um, yeah. She's really pretty, and I really like her, like I said. Maybe I'll do some fun videos with her. And I definitely want to put some Barbie clothes on her so she can wear some other things besides this. I'll try some on her. Probably not in a video. I'll probably just do that on my own time. But, yeah, so... Thanks for watching. Please click like and subscribe and in the comments let me know if you watch Project MC Squared. I'll see you guys later. Bye!